Good morning, Nick. That's right. I'm here at the Palmer Garden Apartments in West Toledo, where a call came in around 1.15 a.m. this morning, and it was a big fire. And I'm here with the apartment owner, um, Latoya Leitner. Latoya, walk me through what happened this morning. Um, well, I went to bed around, I'd say, 12.30. Um, had been in the bed about, i say, a half hour when my smoke detector started to go off. Um, I got out of bed, went to my bedroom door, and when I opened it, I was immediately hit with smoke. So um, when I peeked down my stairs, I didn't see, like, the glow of fire. So I went to my son's room um, to rouse him because he's the hardest of the three kids to wake up. And um, when I roused him, um, I then went to my niece and nephew's room to um, get them out of bed. And I noticed my niece didn't have any clothes on. And I know she gets hot, so I didn't really think anything of it. Just told her to get out of bed and put something on really quick. Yeah. So she was getting um, down out of the top bunk to get something on. So I went back to my son's room to make sure he was getting up because I know he likes to fall back asleep. So I go back in and I'm like, I need you to get up now. The house is on fire. And he jumps up and he puts his flip-flops on and tries to go down the stairs. And he's hit with smoke and he's coughing and saying his eyes is burning. And so I peek around again and the smoke is like even worse than when I had peeked. So I'm back in my niece and nephew's room. I grab my nephew, I hand him to my son and my niece is like, you know, looking at me like, okay, what's going on? And Annika. so, yes. And so then I'm like, okay, we got to go out the window because we can't go down the stairs. It's just too much smoke. <clears throat> Excuse me. And, and this window is the one we're right behind us. The yes. Okay. And I'm like, okay, we're going to go through the window in my room because I know there's a ledge we can at least sit on until, you know, All somebody right. arrives. And All right. we go and I lift up the window. And as soon as the air comes in, it makes the smoke 20 times worse. And then from there, you just, it was so much smoke that you couldn't see your niece and once, somewhere once she had, got yeah, lost. Once I kicked out the window, I went out, I'm holding the blinds and the um, curtain. I go out, you know, they're coming out and I thought Danica was gonna come out behind my son and she does it. Okay, well that's, that's all we have time for right now. Thank you so much.